Happy Saturday, people. Um, it's Candace checking in. Um, just wanted to uh, wish you all a productive and safe and fun-filled and uh, just a good Saturday, a great weekend. I just wanted to check in with you guys because I'm starting work in a few and I'm waiting for my assignment, so I had a little downtime. And you guys know how much I love makeup. So I decided to do a quick look and I wanted to show you, you know, the products that I use. Um, for starters, I started off with Milani's I Heart You Eyeshadow. It's a baked eyeshadow. You can use it either wet or dry. And number one is 602. Came out a while back, but I haven't really used it much. I think I used it like twice and I didn't like how it came out both times. So I decided today and today came out pretty cool. Um, there it is, you know, hopefully you can see that, okay, so that was that, I put a little black in the crease, and for my highlights, I don't always use a highlight, but you know, today I was just bored, so I use Wet n Wild um, Vanity Palette, I actually use this color right here, if you can see it, so the color right, right here, alright, um, and I finished it off with uh, L'Oreal's Voluminous uh, Carbon Black Mascara. It's a pretty good mascara. Just started using it. Um, I contoured with uh, L'Oreal Queen Collection uh, Bronzer, um, an Ebony Bronze. And, I mean, CoverGirl, excuse me, CoverGirl. Um, then I used Wet n Wild Berry Shimmer Blush. $2.99. This blush is the truth. You have to get it. If you don't have it, man, I don't know what you're thinking, but you really need to get it. It looks great on most skin tones. It's really, really pretty. Really, really pretty blush. Okay. Um, for my lips, I used my girl Elizabeth Arden. I got this from a Christmas uh, kit or whatever a few Christmases ago don't use it much but it's really it's like a really nice nude for my complexion like a pinky nude and it's called exceptional lipstick and soft red so that's that and for my lip gloss I use young blood and this is in champagne ice this is a really nice lip gloss really expensive though. um there's that it has a doe foot applicator and um that's it, you know, basically, um, so, just want to let you guys know that I am a blogging fool, I love to write about fashion and beauty and entertainment, it's just something that I gravitate toward, and I blog every day, so if you yourself like to read about that type of stuff, I encourage you to go and check out my blog, do so, do so. Um, La Dolce Vita Fashion Fix and the web address is www.ldvfashionfix.com um, Just this week I did a breakdown of um, Tyra Banks' look on the cover of I Love You magazine. That's a German uh, publication. She did a bright um, yellow lid and I found some um, great products that could you know you could possibly duplicate the look and um, I covered, you know, different um, trends. I did a sneaker post. A lot of people, you know, sneakers have been forgotten a lot lately. Like, all we do is wear our heels and our flats and stuff like that. But I love me some sneaks. So I found some cool, fashionable high tops for ladies so we can look chic, too. Um, what else did I do this week? There's a lot. There's a lot of stuff. Um, I did a breakdown of Joan Small's look at the MoMA event. She wore this beautiful Tom Ford lace um, cocktail dress. Black. It was so sexy and so chic. And I mean like lace, black lace is just such a huge trend for the holidays. You know, you want to look sophisticated, yet chic and pulled together. So I found some great um, alternatives for that. And yeah, it's a bunch of great stuff. Um, so if you could give yourself a minute to go to www.ldvfashionfix.com. And if you have any style questions, any beauty um, questions, anything you'd like me to try, um, please let me know. You can send me a message. You can email me at info at 
www.fashionfix.com and um, I'll be happy to give your inquiry a stab. So um, yeah, that's about it. I think that's all I have to talk about. Yeah, so um, I guess I will be talking to you all soon. Alright, bye.